Mario Maker levels. Mario Maker. We'll play some Mario Maker. Is this it? Is this a red coin level? Is this what you wanted me to play? Chompton 2. That's what you wanted me to play? Whatever versus PS4. Uh, I guess it must be this one. All right, sure. I'll play it. Why not? Have I seen Barbie Dreamhouse Adventures? No. You like? I don't like the large buttons on the Pro Controller. They're too large. Uh, okay. What the shit? All right. This is a really long level. Well, if it's got red coins and infinite checkpoints, then I'm cool with that. I mean, he just said red coin. He didn't say infinite checkpoint. Hanging dongers. Yeah, Ghost Hagen's hanging dong in the first five seconds of his level. Longer chain chomps. Why? Who knows? So he wants me to catch that as it's going up. I see. There we go. I'm so accomplished. Checkpoint already. Wow, what, a, what an amazing player I am. All right, what do we got? <laughs> All right, let's do this one first. Let's do a different one. <laughs> let's do a different one. Let's not do that one. Let's never do that one ever again. <laughs> oh my God, man. This shit looks fucking impossible. What do you want me to do? <laughs> we're running out of, I know we're running out of rooms. Whoa. Does have a zero percent clear? I think I think I have I think I have a suspicion why. I think I I think I understand why this has a zero percent clear rate. So. I don't understand what I have to do in any of the rooms. I have no idea what I'm doing in any of these rooms. <laughs> I'm going to be here all day. Just have to keep believing. All right, let's we're going to commit to this one, I guess. Committed to the wrong one. Blaming Panga for the fire bar. So I have to stay there because I can, there's no way I can spin on the right one. Oh my God. Or the bottom one? I did try the bottom one. I mean, this is just like, this is literally just like trial and error and guesswork to figure out where to land on these chain chomps for like a really long time. Cause I don't suspect this is going to be a short section. <laughs> I mean, like, maybe? I have no idea. Maybe? I don't think this level is bad. I think it's just one of those things that's going to be way easier with a, cl with a clear video. Way, way easier with a clear video. Because otherwise... Otherwise, I'm just going to be sitting here all day to figure this out, right? So, I feel like that's wrong because there's nowhere for me to go from there so like where do i even go from there even if i did that right generally i i a long time ago i kind of for, for me anyway i kind of changed i kind of stopped playing levels in mario maker that i like i had no hope of beating without a video like, i love playing hard levels but if i need a video and i have to like study a video just to just to figure out what to do i usually just don't play those levels and i like hard levels i like kaizo levels but um Usually that that's kind of just my own personal preference. Having a good day? Yeah, I'm having a great day. I legitimately just don't see what to do. 
Maybe I should try a different room. Let's try a different room. So is that just, I'm just dead? Okay, I thought that was a reset. It looks like it's just death. I don't see what to do in that room either. <laughs> <laughs> I don't see what I don't see what to do in any of these rooms. So I feel like I gotta catch it as it's coming back and then catch it when it's on the right. Okay, well at least this room kind of makes a little bit more sense to me. There's a zero percent chance of me beating this level without the clear video, probably. I don't think I don't think ghost I don't I think if there's anything I think the Mario Maker community as a whole could improve on. And if there's if there's one thing I do better, thank you. Thank you for the video. There's one thing I do better than a lot of other creators in Mario Maker. Maybe I make janky ass, dumbass levels. I make some pretty okay to blind levels. Like my levels are not that bad to blind. That's like the one thing I do. If you want me to beat this, do you guys want me to beat this? Nobody's beating this level. Do you guys want me to fucking beat this? It's gonna take, uh, there's no fucking way I'm gonna beat this level in a fucking hour. There's no goddamn way I'm gonna beat this level in a fucking hour. I'm only streaming for another hour. There's not a single fucking way I'm gonna beat that level in this level in an hour. <laughs> Which room was even the easiest? Like what room do I even do? I think this level is cool. I just think it's really hard. <laughs> I think it's cool. This would take me like an all, this would take me all fucking day to beat this one. Cam is fixed. Webcam. There you go. Is that what you wanted? <sighs> Ain't nobody got time for that. I mean, I'll, I'll give it the old college try here. Like, what else am I doing? Peak performance. Duo Maxwell. Didn't I? I literally just thanked you. No, no, no. I didn't thank you. I thanked Death Scythe yesterday. <laughs> Got the two of you confused. Thank you very much. When Ghost Sagan complains about levels, like, I, a lot of times when I complain about levels, I'm completely full of shit. When Ghost Sagan complains about levels, he is maximum full of shit. For the record. He is literally could not possibly be ma more full of shit than I am. Like he is complete 100% full of shit. Every complaint he ever throws at a level. Yeah, it's, it's at the complete. There's no possible way of being more full of shit. Go Sagan was complaining about that Bufflin level that had munchers and how the level was terrible. And then he fucking submits this shit to me. He was mad at that like 2% Bufflin clear rate level. And then he sends me this fucking monstrosity. This is Ghost Sagan's level. He was like, hey, Barb, I made a new level. You should check it out. And he sends me like a fucking 11 hour level. <laughs> you know, I get how this is cool, but getting over it level isn't. Uh, well, I mean, it all comes down to personal preference, really. Getting over, it's like a series of shitty jumps over and over. This is also shitty jumps, but at least the shitty jumps are way more interesting. Uh, I think I just, once I land on that, do I just stay on it? I think. Oh, I actually did it. And then I got stuck. If you guys ever watch Go Sagan stream, the next time he's like, oh my God, Bufflin's 5% clear rate muncher levels impossible. Can you guys fucking please call him out on his horse shit? Like please forever call him out on his goddamn bullshit. There we go. Is that what you guys wanted? Don't let him get away with that shit. Oh my God. The muncher hitboxes are terrible. Where am I going? Oh, I jumped to the left. Okay. You can see my pores. 
You're getting so much face. <laughs> I got a lot of face to give. So it's like I kind of got to aim for the middle there. That looks really tough. Then I think I jump over back down, I guess. Ah. Okay, here we go. No, it juked me. So I want to trigger that as soon as I possibly can. Uh, trigger, trigger, trigger. No! Okay. Well, I almost made progress. I almost made progress in this level. <laughs> that, that was that was the final warning that I should just fucking back out now. That was this level's final warning shot across the bow. Advance no further. <laughs> Only Barb could be an asshole to fungi. Listen, I'm, I'm saying that fungi don't deserve it. They don't deserve it, straight up. They don't deserve shit. Okay, so what about the... And like, all life, correct me if I'm wrong, but literally all life on the Earth uh, derives from like the same multicellular organisms that developed like trillions, like billions of years ago or whatever, right? So, humans and a virus, like we all eventually have this, we all have an ancestor, right? So I wonder what, what is the common ancestor between humans and like a virus? Oh no. Fuck man. Probably not sure about that. Fuck. Wait, did I get a coin? I did, didn't I? Fuck, we made progress. Shit. <laughs> God fucking damn it. God, I, the last thing I want to do is make progress in this level. Okay, what was this part? What was this fucking part? What do I fucking do here? Eh? Oh, I got a spin jump on the thwomp. Okay. That was the most ridiculous room. Some humans are closer to this. So, a vi wait, a virus is not life, technically? It's not, it's not life? I thought a virus was like life. Or like a bacteria? Just a theory. What uh, what species on the planet are like the closest? Like, so humans eventually developed into the ability to like develop our own tools and shit, right? Uh, we developed like a higher order of intelligence, right? Uh, what animals on the planet are closest to doing that? Aside from us, like chimps, dolphins, whales. Probably, right? Other primates, dolphins. Well, right, but like actually developing in like intelligence, right? My neighbors probably. <laughs> Bonobos. Maybe crow. Aren't crows? Crows are incredibly intelligent, aren't they? Like what causes this chain, this thwomp to fucking drop anyway? Yeah, crows are, aren't crows incredibly fucking intelligent? They find incredibly intelligent. Well, crows have like their. It's not only just like crows use tools and shit, but they have like their own like rules and societies and like all this like crazy shit. Okay, I don't remember this part at all. Yeah, totally. It is so unreasonable that you wanted me to play this. <laughs> it is incredibly unreasonable that you wanted me to play this.
Oh, that was actually pretty close. I missed. It's kind of blind. I can't see where I'm going up. Congrats on the house. Yeah, dude. We're so... Oh, my God. We're so excited. Uh, we're spending a lot of time looking at things like uh, furniture and uh, appliances and shit. So... We're so excited, dude. Oh my god. We can't wait. Yeah, it's our first home. We've we've had we've had uh apartments for a long time. It is our first home. IKEA everything. We've had well we've had IKEA furniture before. I think we'd rather have something that would like last longer. I know I haven't found a good desk. I need a desk. I need people to send me links to desks that are either made of stone or like metal. Like huge open desks that are made of stone or metal. Are the only things that are gonna cut it. You can't do a full jump there, okay. Nope. So is this resettable? Wait, I spawned that thing on the right. I'm probably fucked no matter what, aren't I? What kind of fucking bullshit was that? The fuck was that? Like, there's no way that was there was no way I could have possibly made that how in the fuck would I would have made that every section is more of like a figure out what to do and then try to execute it but right now I'm just I don't know I wonder if there's like a right time I should try to trigger the thwomp like to make it work but I don't know No, I actually made it over. Is that where I should have spin jumped to the right? Is that what I do? Hang on, hang on, hang on. I actually, that's the first time I fucking made it over. Uh. No, come on, you fucking cunt. Fuck. There's no goddamn dev path, all right? Shut the hell up. No, there's no way. So can I reset that part? That chain chomp spawning there makes me feel like I can't respawn it. I feel like I can't, but I guess we'll try. Oh, you can. Oh, it wasn't even there for me. I gotta wait longer. I gotta wait longer. All right, we're getting there. We're getting there. Oh, dude, cunt is such a great word. <laughs> what am I going to make a cuss word tier list? I feel like cunt, cunt, fuck are S plus tier. Fuck is amazing. The one thing about cunt that kind of sets it back a little bit is that I feel like uh, there's like a weird hang up about the word cunt in the States. You can call somebody a fucking giant pile of shit in America, and it's like, ah, eh, whatever. Call somebody a cunt, and it's like, <gasps> he said cunt. I wonder, are there any American words? I, you know, in, in America, I think, I feel like bullshit. I don't think people say bullshit much. And uh, I feel like that's very American to say bullshit. They say bullshit very much in like Britain and shit. I feel like not, not much. Uh, shit, yes. Something, it's something it really captures the rural pastoralism of, of the Americas. Things like chicken shit, bullshit, horse shit. Twat is real bad in the UK. I think if you called somebody a twat in America, they'd just laugh. I don't think, I don't think they would take that one seriously. Dude, has anybody been watching that, that new game? It's like a Dark Souls, but it takes, it's, it's like a Souls game. Uh, uh. that yeah remnant yeah remnant how how is that is anybody playing that pretty fun i fuck i want to fucking play that that game looks sick remnant sucks yeah hobbs and playing it i know uh lobos been playing it 
it's like souls post apocalyptic is like imagine dark souls plus fallout is what it looks like to me oh yeah i'm definitely not gonna i'm not gonna start anything until i beat god of war like sometimes like like i did everything right and i just don't make it that fucking sucks dude that just feels bad it feels bad when you do everything and you don't die because of shit out of your control it just sucks feels bad i think i think ghost sagan sending this level to me just goes to show that ghost sagan just really doesn't like me i think i think ghost sagan doesn't like me i streamed for four hours and i had to take a nap yeah exactly it's been a hard day streaming uh, i'll see you guys in a week a three hour stream today we put in three hours uh, i'll see you guys tomorrow night for another hour session In all seriousness, though, uh, it is it is a problem for streamers who like are super overworked, you know, like, I don't know, because it's like I feel like a lot of streamers are who stream a lot. And I can say this for myself are very much driven by like fear, you know, like you're afraid, like if you stop streaming, people won't watch you. If you stop streaming, you're going to lose all your subscribers and stuff. So like fear for streamers, because there's not a lot of job security, right? Like. Streaming could be very here today, gone tomorrow. So, uh, it's an interesting question. Uh, fucked up channel to get you in hot water and you pretty much solidified your spot on Twitch. No, I don't agree. I think that Twitch is a constantly changing, uh, is a constantly changing, like volcanic ocean of like rising, falling, exploding. This person rises really fast and then can fall a week. I think that that happens. And I think that occasionally there are streams out there that are like rock solid granite that will always be huge. But uh, I don't think I'm one of those streams. Maybe someday I could be, but I don't think I'm one of those. My stream hasn't been around long enough. My stream, I, I've only I've only been partnered for less than less than three years. You know what? Usually when, usually when I play a hard level, I'm like, man, this streamer owes me. Like, Panga owes me one. He's got, Panga's got to play my level. You know, fuck that. Go Sagan owes me like 50 bucks. <laughs> fuck that. I don't need Go Sagan to play my shit. 50 bucks. You owe me 50 fucking bucks. That's rising. I'm going to, I'm going to have, I need like a, I need a New York taxi fare. I'm going to put the meters running, Go Sagan. Meter's fucking running. The longer it takes me, the higher the meter goes up. <laughs> oh. Dark Souls bonfire painting. All right, two down, fucking three torture fests to go. All right, what's the next room? This room looks fucking agonizing. Oh my god. Am I ever doing a Grand Portal 3? No. This room actually looks the, one of the worst to me. You made any other games other than the Grand Pools? Yeah, I made an SMB3 hack called Kamikaze Bros. It's really old and bad. But... So I guess I need to jump again there, right? Uh, Ghost Sagan was like, play my level. I was like, all right, I'll play your level. Kamikaze Bros is great. Yeah, Kamikaze Bros is hard. Oh my god! This level's impossible! Oh my god! This 3% clear rate level! It has a muncher! Oh my god! Oh, 
Okay, so that was right. I think I have to spin jump on it again. Hang on. So that was right, and then over to the right. Okay, okay. I think we, I think we got that. I think we're getting there. Ah, shit. What I call this a good level? Yes. It's just really hard and difficult to do without a video. But yes, I would say this is a very good level. Very, all the rooms are cool. They don't really have a flow and they're not like, none of the rooms are fun, but they're very cool. I think Ghost Sagan is more on the cool side of, of level design and less on the fun side. If that makes sense. And that's not meant as a dig. His levels are more cool than fun. So wait, I was... I have to like cut my jump somewhere because I was too slow. Where the hell do I cut my jump? I'm aiming for shit I can't see. Where the hell is it? This is not the first time Ghost Sagan has debated me into playing one of his levels, is it? No, just... I want to land because I want to. I know I'm fucking it up, but I want to get to the next part. All right, that was actually good. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and we're gonna. I'm gonna come back to this level. Uh, I'm just gonna put my switch on sleep mode. Uh, we're going to come back to this level. I've got two red coins. We're going to come back to this one uh, later on another stream. Uh, Ghost Sagan's level. Started this yesterday. Uh, how many coins did I get? I got only got two of the coins. So we are uh, not quite half the way, half of our way there. But uh, picking up exactly where we left off. Exactly where we left off. So this is, uh, is going to take a while. This is going to take a while. But let's get right back in. Yeah, we're right, we're right back in this. We're right back in this one. But yeah, I hope you guys are all doing well. Uh, that's about as far as I've made it. That's, it's really hard. A lot of this, a lot of the jumps here are just straight up blind. You just gotta know where you're going. I should never have agreed to play this. Is this still Go Sagan's level? Yes. Yes, it is. This is, this is Go Sagan's adventure in regret and spite. God. I don't find this level uh, particularly enjoyable when the inside of your ear itches. Is this magnum opus? No. If this level didn't have checkpoints, it would have definitely been among the hardest levels in Mario Maker 2, though. Like, so I guess that has to be a really short control jump. Okay. Is God of War worth buying a PS4 to play? I don't know if I'd buy a PS4 at this point, right? Like, it's so late in the game. There's a lot of... There's there's a whole lot of uh, amazing games for PS4, though. But they've already said PS5 is going to be backwards compatible. Right? Isn't that, like, already a thing? Fuck, man. I'm trying to get the momentum to go left. Psycho made a ROM Mac. Yeah, the pro here's the problem with Psycho's levels is that... Uh... For one thing, I don't want to fucking brick my Switch to play one Mario Maker level. Uh, hold left, hold left, hold left. Oh! Okay, so that was all right. I land on the spring. Okay. I don't want to fucking brick my Switch, and I don't want to fuck anything over just to play one level. I don't care what it looks like. If I want to play something crazy, I'll just go play a ROM hack. I, I, a long time ago, I, I think I got pretty bothered in Mario Maker 1 because in Mario Maker 1, you know, the whole play my level shit that definitely existed in Mario Maker 1. Like people were desperate for other people to play their levels. No doubt about it. Like sometime at the beginning of Mario Maker 1, I was like, man, I really don't want to bother people to play my levels because like my levels are really hard. I'm not going to fucking annoy anybody. So I, I pretty much decided I would I would never ask anybody to play any of my levels. Like occasionally I would submit a level. Like uh I submitted Master and Commander to the Beast. That might have been the last time I ever submitted a level of mine to somebody. 
was when I submitted Master and Commander to the Beast. That might have been my last submission. Um, it's bullshit that Ghost Hagen asked me to play this. <laughs> it's bullshit. It was like, can you take, can you spend like 10 hours, Barb? Can I have 10 hours of your time? It's bullshit. Okay. One, two, three. Left. No, come on. I, I, like, it's a bunch of shit that I have no control over. Like, I couldn't fucking see that. How am I supposed to, like, what do I do? Watch out for that? What the fuck do I even do about that? It's, it's a giant blind jump down, and there's a shit that I have no idea it's there that kills me. Oh, okay, okay. I remember this. I remember this. All right. We just have to fucking make this goddamn jump. Barb doesn't mock people enough anymore. Yeah, I've gotten that before. So I feel like I want to jump when it's moving to the left. Too early. I'm gonna die. No! <laughs> Look at how close I was. Look at how fucking close I was. Come on. Ah! Uh, I was so goddamn close on that one. You first started watching me during the making of Grand Proto. I remember uh, what led to that. I liked. Uh, I'll always remember. I mean, like. I guess, yeah, I guess like I'll say that. Like, I always remember making uh, Grand Pearl 2 fondly on stream. It had its ups and downs like any other time, but it was just, uh, it was just really cool to have such a long project and, and work it and then see it come to fruition and see people play it and enjoy it. It was just, it was, it was special. It was really special. I don't think, I don't think, even if I decided to make another ROM mech on stream, I don't think I could ever replicate that. Even if I did decide it. No. I think sometimes when something is good, I think living up to it would be really hard. Even when I started, like... The first couple days of get of Grand Portal 2 were pretty miserable, actually. Like, the first... Probably, like, the first two or three streams. Because I said, like, I'm going to make Grand Portal 2. And I started streaming Lunar Magic. And then I had, like, a whole chat of people who were like... Eh, this looks this doesn't look very good. This looks mediocre. This doesn't look very good at all. That was like day one of making it. And I feel like if I did decide to do something again, it would be similar. I don't know. Like, yeah, I could just ignore it, but like ignoring it, ignoring it works. Ignoring stuff works to a point. Ignoring stuff works until it doesn't. And then it's just, oh my god, I don't fucking want to do this anymore. You know? I don't know if that makes any sense. Like, I can have a pretty thick skin on some things, but eventually it's just like... Eventually it becomes a problem of motivation and staying motivated. Yeah, and... You know. What if I, what if I start... What if I go back to... What if I, if, what if I did go back to Lunar Magic and it took me a long time to, like, even have anything remotely that I thought was good? People would be like, wow, pff, art fucking sucks. And like, I don't know. Anyway, like I said, I have, I have absolute zero plans to do that. Ah. Okay. Attempt number two. I'm like, I'm too fast. I'm too fast. I gotta slow the fuck down. All right, attempt number three. Let's see if we want to do it when it's coming from the left. Yeah, let's try it coming from the left. Left was easier, apparently. I got a first try. Third time is the charm. Okay, we're over halfway there. All right. 
Oh, uh, which room do I fucking want? I guess let's try this one. Let's try the other one, maybe. You missed a coin. No, that's the safety coin. You don't want to get that coin until the very, very end. Uh, you want to you want to wait on that coin. Uh, thank you, Getty Pops. Yeah, I started this. I started with this level. I have to start with this level. I don't have a choice. Hold right. Hold right. Yeah. Have I beaten all the trials in God of War? Yeah, I beat all the. I beat all the trials, and then I beat the Valkyrie. Uh, I beat two Valkyries last night. I beat the one in Muspelheim, and then I beat the one in Helheim. Valkyries are no joke. I think the hardest one so far was... I don't know. None of them felt that bad to me last night. None of them felt all that bad to me last night. I did both of them pretty... The one in Muspelheim was definitely harder than the one in Helheim. But the one in Muspelheim wasn't all that bad. So I guess I'm supposed to land there and then go back left, I think. Land there and then go back left. All right, that actually seemed pretty close. That actually seemed pretty close. Well, okay, so here's the here's the problem with PS3. PS3 has some anti-piracy thing built into it, so that if you want to stream it, you have to break, you have to have a splitter, uh, and you have to reroute your HDMI through that splitter. It's not that bad, it's just annoying the setup, and it's... It's just annoying. It's just annoying. Yeah, I forget the actual name of it. I went through that when I when I had to play Demon Souls. It's why it's why I don't really play Demon Souls again or anything like that. Would Demon Souls be part of the Future Souls Marathon? No. I've only played Demon Souls once. Okay, that room wasn't that bad at all. That room really wasn't that bad. One to go. Is Demon Souls worth playing? Uh, yeah, I'd say so. When is the Souls Marathon? I have no idea. Uh, I've seen the new Majora's Mask any percent route. I've heard about it. I've heard some people like complaining about it, but I haven't. I haven't seen it now. Isn't this the worst room? I don't know. I don't know. We only just got in here. Maybe this room's not that bad once you just look at the video. I look great today. Uh, thanks. Whenever I hear people say I look good, I always, I always assume that they're trolling or something. Well, I don't want to play God of War. What am I going to do? Play the entire God of War series backwards? I think that was right. I think that was right. <laughs> sure, yeah. Okay, yeah, totally. No, that was good. I think I almost had it. Okay. I feel like your level doesn't require looking up clear vids. Uh, yeah, I generally think that's kind of like the the a more ROM hacky style of level design, because ROM hacks obviously do not have they don't have clear vids or editor, so that's kind of the style I sort of cleave to. Yeah, Twitch is being weird today. Don't worry about it. It's not your fault. You know, all right, all right. You know what? I have literally heard, I have literally heard Go Sagan go on and off about great, a Kaizo block. Great, 
Oh, such brilliant level design. I've literally heard the man go on and on about how no Kaijo blocks. I've literally heard this motherfucker go on forever about Kaizo blocks. I've literally heard his fucking ass. The, Go Sagan is the biggest fucking hypocrite I have ever goddamn met. What a fucking hypocrite. What is this nonsense? Okay. Easy. All right, are we done here? I've literally heard this man go on and on and on. God, I'm fucking scared of this. Is this the, so this is the shame path? So you, you have to wait here. Just to get it to go. All right. True ending. Yeah, fuck that. Easy. <laughs> All right. Look, it did. Look, it only took me like an hour this morning. For a hey, seventy fifty one first clear, bitches. Beat that time, motherfuckers. <laughs> Not max timer. There you go. Go Sagan. Never send me a level ever again. I should have left a comment. I should have left a comment. Hang on. There we go. Way my level. There we go. I think we're good. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that is. This has been an episode. <laughs> I like Ghost Sagan with the glass of wine. This has been an episode of Arts with Barbara's King. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys hope we've all learned something about the artistic process and about one another. There we go. <laughs> Where can you buy a print of this? There we go. Oh, we can do display comments. <laughs> Dude, I like how he like just appears. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> yeah, we gotta we gotta make sure. Yeah, he like peekaboo's. So I think Pooh is gonna play this level. We have to make sure Pooh turns comments on, and it'll just it'll just jump scare and appear. That's even better. <laughs> We're out of here. Really cool level. Uh, with, if you play it, definitely recommend you use the video. And I am the only human to clear it. All right. Goodbye forever, Go Sagan. <laughs>